Yesterday, I uploaded a video of 19-year-old me reading one of my poems. There's actually a lot of video I took of myself as a first year in college that never made it to YouTube, including this charming one of me testing out my new camera. You recognize my face? That's, that's even, that's kind of cool and weird. At the same time, let's we'll see if we can zoom. Zoom all the way out. Oh, zooming in. <laughs> There's a couple of attempts to set up a good camera angle for vlogging, and a very brief tour of my room from back when I lived on the first floor of BJ at the University of Chicago. You know you go to U Chicago, by the way, when you can talk about living in BJ without giggling. Here we have my desk, my bed, sorta of made, sorta of not. But it mostly seems like I would feel inspired to make a video, get out my camera, and then just chicken out. Looking back at this footage gives me a few feelings right away. First of all, those Converse shoes. They're the only pair of Converse I've ever had. I love Converse, actually. I think they're really cute, but they're not the right shape for my feet, and I just walk around too much, so I wore these out pretty quickly. And that makes me sad. Second, I remember my wall decorations from that year as being really dorky, but this looks quite tasteful, to be honest. Especially the collection of family photos I got when I was worried I'd be homesick. I think I was too hard on myself. And that brings me to my last point. According to the dates on my computer, these videos were recorded on the first few days of April 2014. At around 3 in the morning on May 1st, I came out for the first time, in the house lounge a few doors down. In high school, I was just too busy with homework to really care what people thought of me. But in these videos, I'm in the closet. There's a lot about myself I'm hiding here, and I think I was just too shy to post anything to YouTube. You might consider that a step backwards from high school, but I think of it as a necessary step in the process. It was at this point in my life when I started asking myself, what kind of person do I want to be? What kind of friend? I kind of want to give 19-year-old me a hug and say, there's some tough times ahead, and you're definitely not done figuring yourself out, but it's all going to be okay.